Hola mis amores, welcome back, welcome back. Today we have a quick Sephora haul and then I have a few products that I recently purchased from Amazon and Target and I just wanted to share that was with you. Uh, for those of you that don't know me, my name is Yvette and in this channel we talk about anything that is lifestyle, vlogs, makeup, wig, and anything in between. So I hope you guys enjoy the content. Please grab a snack or something because it might be a little lengthy. We have quite a few products here. And I'm just going to jump right into the Sephora box. Um, so I am a VIB member. So I got like the 15%. Um, so I just ordered a few things that intrigued me and then a couple of items that I wanted to replenish. So the first one was the famous Fenty um, Butter Drop Whipped Buddy Cream situation. I have not smelled this ever. So they didn't have the larger size when I placed my order. They only have like the travel size. So I wanted to try it out. Mmm. -mm. And see. Okay. Ooh, look at that. You know, I'm just late to the party because I have like way too many buddy butters, and I just like, you know. But uh, yeah, uh, I mean, I like the consistency. I like the glistening. I'm not sure about the scent. All right, so that's that. Then from the Sephora line that was having a 30% off, I got the Vitamin C and E Super Glow Serum. And this is good for oily skin. And it said that it helps with, you know, pores. Um, it's for everyday use, AM and PM. Um, and, you know, I was just looking for a vitamin C to try. Um, so, yeah. Had good reviews. So I picked it up. Then from the same Sephora line, I ended up grabbing the Glow Peel Pads. Again, can you see, can you see? I'll link everything down below, there you go. So I will see, this is the Thomas Rod ones. I forgot the name of those, but um, I was using those, I ran out. Those are very expensive. Um, and I decided to give this a try. So it says that it's for all skin type and that you can use this uh, morning and night. And it's pretty much helps with texture and all that. So I hope these work. Then from the Inky List, I got the Omega Water Cream. So this is pretty much a moisturizer. Uh, you can either use AM or PM, and since it's water-based, it's supposed to really hydrate um, oily skin and controls the oil. I have been using it for the past few days, since I got my box about two, three days ago, and it's, it's pretty decent. It's pretty decent. It does, it absorbs, but it leaves your face radiant, but not greasy. So yeah, that's that. I have a whole bunch of products for the, from the Inky List and I really um, enjoy the brand. So then from Givenchy, I ended up ordering the Prism Libre powder, you know, the face powder that everybody's talking about. And I got it in the medium tan. So yeah, I did not want to buy the larger pod because why? Why would I want to do that? I have so many powders too. But you know the Givenchy, you, know, you guys know it. Oh, it looks like a little puffer. Tiny itty bitty puffer. So yeah. I wanted to give this a try. You know how I usually do. I try to get the small, the travel size first. See if I like the product and then commit to the full size product. So that. 
then Natasha, Tasha Washa, was talking about this from Costa Sport. It's a deodorant, okay? And she was saying how she started using this and within about two weeks, she noticed that her armpits were getting lighter. Um, and I was like, okay, add to cart. Um, Cause I deal with a lot of hyperpigmentation. I usually wax right now and I use the, the one that I use right now to lighten up my armpits is this one. I've talked about it before, but I wanted to try something different. So I tried it for the first time today, like going to work. So I put it on this morning to see how it would be, how if it, you know what I mean, how it's gonna be musty or whatnot. And it is just phenomenal. I, I don't think it has any scent. Maybe it does like a little bit of a green tea scent, but it is, you know, a little tube with a roll on. So it's H A H A deodorant. So anything that's gonna help my armpits, I am jumping to get it. All right, then from the ordinary, I order my niacinamide uh, serum. So it's pretty much this one. And I just ordered, just did a focus, 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 focus. Well, yeah. So I order a backup. Why? This is the same size? Oh yeah, it is. Okay, yeah. So I ordered this one. Then, from the same brand, The Ordinary, I ordered the Glycolic Toning Solution. I mean, I use this thing everywhere. Like I've mentioned before, I use this on my face. I use this on my inner thighs. I use this on my armpits. And it has worked tremendously, especially my inner thighs and my bikini line to lighten it, to um, just help with any little bumps and whatnot. This has been working. This has been working very, very good. Like I'm on bottle, I, I don't know, four or five, maybe number five. So this is my back backup because that one was running out. But this I recommend, you know, blind buy if you have not used this. It works everywhere. It does not irritate your skin. I believe it's good on sensitive skin. And it works wonders for me. All right. From The Ordinary, I got a salicylic acid blemish prone skin. So I've been breaking out a lot whenever I got my period. So I decided just to give this a try and see how it works. You know, any 2% salicylic acid, anything salicylic acid works just great on my skin. Um, so yeah, I was just like really breaking out around here and around here. And I'm like, we can't do this. We, we cannot be having skin like that. Um, one of the little perks was the Spice Bomb Victor and Wolf fragrance so yeah then agua de joe i love this i need to come into the full size but i love this it's such a clean scent then i think this was with my points sunday riley vitamin c if they always have the like the points i always get it i don't know why i'm like so cheap that i just don't buy the full size but this lasts me forever then from the Sephora line, I decided to try a new concealer. So this is the Gel Serum Concealer. And this is in Eclair number 10. Child, I hope this works. This looks a little light. Oh, she looks light, light. It was only like $7.50. It wasn't clearance. Then from Milk, which one's this one? The Modifying Primer from the Milk Brand. So once again, I just had like a travel size. So it's this lightweight, blurs, pours, and controls shine. <laughs> I love everything in that sentence, okay? Everything in that sentence. And then from the same brand, Milk, I ended up getting the Modifying Setting Spray. So yeah, 
so that's all I got from Sephora. I would not... I don't know. I went on the website and... I don't know. I just have so many products. <laughs> and I buy so many backups of the things that I love that I just didn't... I don't know. I didn't find much, I guess. And I didn't want to venture out much because, like I said, my skin... I've been getting, like, a lot of blackheads and whatnot. And I think it's from the super goop sunscreen that i used all summer yeah that did not sit well on me all right moving on from amazon since i have been dealing with problematic face skin you know it's been hating me i ended up getting this mask it is called poor blackhead one shot pack so this is pretty much to deal with your blackhead. It comes with a little spatula. Much appreciated. And this is the consistency of it. It's like that. It has like a funny smell. Um, and it's grainy. So you just apply it for like 10-15 minutes. Um, and then of course you rub it in to get rid of the dead skin. And you can tell a difference. I've been using it for quite some time and I am able to tell a difference in my, you know, all my blackheads and clog pores that I've had around here so it has been working very very well um but you know th the smell it is, if you're sensitive to smell it's not like awful but it has a almost like spoiled lipstick you know when your lipstick is expired <laughs> that's what this reminds me of but you know it doesn't linger but it works really good on your skin. And you know, I like the fact that it has the exfoliating beads that, you know, after you put it on and whatnot, and then you just scrub it in and it, do, it, it does a very good exfoliation on your face. Then to brighten and deep clean my face, I ended up going with this vitamin C and turmeric mask. So yeah, this one too, I mean, I can't say that it has done like magic, but consistency. So it is a very thick paste. Um, it comes with a little brush. You brush it on your face. You also leave it for like 10 to 15 minutes. And like I said, it had these two combined have helped my skin clear it up. All this around. Like I had a lot of blackheads. I mean, very congested. I'm like... I'm 44. I can't be having this. I'm too old to be dealing with blackheads and acne. All right, then. Okay, so the Fenty one. I am hooked on this. This is the Trader Joe's Brazilian Nut Buddy Butter. I use this every single night. I love the nutty it smells so good. It smells like the Sol de Janeiro. This was the one that went viral on TikTok. It's like six dollars, six fifty, I think it is. It is so good. It is so thick and creamy. Jesus. Um. It is so thick and creamy. Uh, I, you know, it's great to just lather yourself at night before you go to bed because then your skin is like supple and moisturize in the morning i i just love this i just love me i have me a buck up and i have this one and i'm almost done with this one and you can't go wrong for six dollars and fifty cents you cannot go wrong so i'm gonna run to trader joe's and grab me some more because this is this is good this is some good buddy butter good buddy butter all right then when it comes to exfoliating my skin i discovered this um i was using the tea tree hot ones and the dove uh, but the dr teals to relax and relieve eucalyptus with spearmint and special in, in essential oils <laughs> eucalyptus spearmint and essential oils child i can't even speak um smells very herbally but i i just i really like this i think it does a really good job um it doesn't leave my tub like slimy and none of that which is a plus even though it has oils but it does work really good like once again i use this on my underarms 
in between my thighs, exfoliating my legs after I shave and all that. So it works really, really good. This is the most effective body scrub of them all. I think it works wonders. And, you know, on my skin is the KP uh, by First Aid Beauty. Um, this is a larger size. I usually get it on sale. They usually have like a 30% off. So it's not as expensive. Uh, but it lasts me forever and it works so, 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 so well. So I always, always will repurchase this. But I alternate. I might use this, switch to those, and switch to another one that I'm about to show you. But this works really, really good. It has worked really good on my skin. You know, I had like bumping skin around here. And once again, like before I get a wax, I, you know, my armpits, my hoo-ha, all that. Another combination of body scrub is the verse. I've talked about this before. I get this at Target. I get the set. This is the body lotion. So the body lotion has retinol. And, you know, this is the AHA exfoliant um, scrub. This is very grainy and almost harsh. It is not, no, it's just like the little grains are thicker. So it feels harsh, but it's not harsh on my skin. At least I don't have sensitive skin. So I can actually use this on a daily. I can use this on a daily and nothing happens to me. And then I combine this with that, especially like on my butt to have a very uh, luscious and, you know, smooth derriere. <laughs> I use the scrub and then I combine it with this and it works really, really well. Um, I keep repurchasing these and, and they, just, they just work great, great, great. And my new discovery i had no idea i had this is the latest discovery and i am just blown away the notorium line so someone's really in a rush trying to get a hold of me so i bump into this looking something on pinterest and i was like oh Okay, let me try this. This one is the Glow Getter Multi Oil Body Wash. I have tried many oil gels, body oils in shower situations. Nothing compared to this. Once again, the Glow Getter Multi Oil Body Wash. It's like $14, I think, something like that. It's over $10, less than $15. This is like an oil to gel. When I tell you that your skin is going to be so soft, so shiny, so amazing after using this, I was blown away. I was like, where have you been? Where have I been doing all this time? I would not go back. I would not go back. I would repurchase this over and over and over. Um, it says that it has linoleic oils, it's squalene and glycerin. I mean, whatever it has, it works on your body so, so well. Then this one is the Smoother Glycolic Acid Body Wash. So this one is an exfoliant and it's also to smooth, smooth your skin and whatnot. This, one, this is the first one that I actually try. When I purchase them all, I purchase like a couple of them and then I wash myself with this one. And I was like, what? Even after I shower and I was drying myself and then I came in to put on lotion, I was like, I am so soft. It was just, I don't know what's in this thing. I, I don't know what it is, but, and it does not leave a film. Neither of them leave a film. Um, but your body is so much moisturized. Like, I just, I don't have words to explain. I really don't. I, you guys have to go try it for yourself. And then the last one that I got is the salicylic acid because, you know, sometimes I do have back knee, butt knee, or whatever you want to call it. I break out on my back and my butt. And I figured that it would be nice, you know, if you shave to have like maybe ingrowns. I don't know. I'm just thinking that it might be good because it has salicylic acid, okay? 
I have not tried this one uh, because I'm going, I have always so many in the shower, so I need to stick to a regimen. So right now, this is what I'm doing. So I'm the type of person that I rinse like three times. So I might use a bar soap to start. Then I go with this one and then I finish with this one. And when I tell you, I'm like, oh my God, I don't even want to put lotion after I'm done. But then I do, you know, end up at night putting this on. But your legs are so shiny, your arms, your chest is just, I don't know. This brand is doing it. And I know they have like face products and whatnot. And I have not, like once again, like I heard of it, but I never bothered to read about it or try. The best, the best. I think I got me two of these, two of these and only one of these and I'm still going back to one because I know I'm gonna drink this. I am going to drink this. So yeah, go get you some of that. Out of everything that I mentioned, go try these. Go please try these. <laughs> okay, so that is that for tonight. I just wanted to show you what I got from the Sephora sale which wasn't much and some of the products that I've been loving lately. Um, I'm gonna link everything down below and please do not forget to like comment and subscribe today i was filming with a new mic because i noticed that my last vlog the audio <laughs> was struggling here but we're gonna make it through we're gonna make it through so yes so that is the end of this video mis amores I hope everyone has an amazing day, night, morning, whenever you watch this. Once again, please, please do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. It really helps your girl out. Um, and I hope you get to test out any of the products that I've mentioned today. So I will see you on our next clip, on our next video, on our next, on our next vlog, on our next adventure. So, okay. Bye, Miss Amores.